we've done with our football program is we've constructed their program in a way that the, the junior class will go every spring break. University spends a lot of effort in, in Elon being one of the leaders in study abroad. A couple of years back, we had to discover what we we're going to do with uh, athletes. It's been, uh, I don't know, five years if it's been that long about uh, trying to get all our teams to go abroad. And we ran into what are we going to do with football? Large group, the NCAA wants you to uh, compete. Supposedly, when you're out, and that's impossible. We came up with the idea of letting the junior class travel abroad and do service work. It was a spring break study abroad trip, seven days from Saturday to Saturday. During the trip, we held a football camp for some of their high school kids. Costa Rica was an awesome experience, just for, I guess for me, not being able to go out of the country a lot, just because I played football growing up and have a lot of practices and never being able to get out and go places. I thought the Costa Rica trip that was led by the football team was an awesome experience. The biggest impact I had was definitely we went down there, we talked to the Costa Rican football team, which is like a, one of their own teams, and just it was kind of with like kids kind of our age and younger and all across the board and just being able to teach them like basic, I guess like fundamentals of football and just how much they looked up to us was something that was just amazing. They looked up to us like we were just crazy superstars, but like something you don't get a lot, I guess, in America because there's a lot of football players, but like in Costa Rica, we looked up just a lot of tall players and they were just amazed. And it was awesome to just put a little bit of our light on football and give them a little aspect, a little bit of insight of like what we think football is and seeing them just light up when they see us and taking in everything we're giving them. I thought just really teaching like the younger kids and just anything we could was like the best part about it. Uh, it was definitely something that I uh, wasn't expecting, you know, with our busy schedules being student athletes and football specifically year round, you don't really hear about teams being able to study abroad or football players being able to study abroad. So having this opportunity was huge. Just the cultural side of just getting out there and seeing new cultures and meeting new people, different languages and just trying to inter interact as us as a football team, I really liked it. I didn't even think this was a, a thing in general. And then once I decided to come here, this was a big thing that they, that they threw out there. Like, we're here, we're trying to win a CAA championship, trying to go to the playoffs, do, uh, do great things. But on the academic side, this is what we can offer. And we have this study abroad program that's unlike anything else in the country. Coming to play football, you never think that you're going to have time to study abroad. Maybe your senior year or like second semester. But like the fact that I get to study abroad like halfway through my career and then do it with my teammates, I thought that was awesome and I was so so pumped and, and it turned out to be an awesome experience and I loved, loved that every moment of it. I don't know of anybody else that's doing this and why this would not catch on. I can't put a value or words of, of what I've experienced of watching them. Before we take the trip, I stand up in front of him and goes, you can take trips like this with your family and you can take trips like this with your friends. You can't put a price tag on taking a trip like this with your teammates that they will never forget and live with a lifetime with this memory is, is like. <laughs>